guys, it's Desi from Living in Slopes and today we are at CityServe which is a volunteer service here on campus that helps ministries help their families in need. So today we're going to be volunteering here and helping these families and yeah, let's go. We're looking for the guy with long hair again. There he is. I think his name is Steve. Steve. Might be wrong. Steve? Yeah. yeah he looks like a Steve. We're not sure. <laughs> I'm like 45% sure, but last time I was here, he didn't have long hair. 45% is not that confident. Down there. Yep, I see him. Okay, sounds awesome. Cool. What are we doing? Blanket. Did any of you hear that? Or no. Just me? no, I was just no, you. Wait, is okay. his name Steve? Blankets and pillows <laughs> in here. <laughs> but we are taking the blankets and putting them here and here. And then the pillows are on the other aisle at the very end, this like metal shelving unit. Okay, so okay. should we do the blankets first? Well, it's all what there, he said. So, uh, so CityServe, uh, currently it's a hub where uh, extra goods from Amazon, Costco, and some other areas are sent here to be dispersed for uh, charitable organizations and churches and stuff like that so that families and uh, communities in need can get some resources and supplies that they need. So we're going to keep four of them that are nice. As with the rest of them break down, Okay. Does that work? Yeah. yeah. Should I do it like one of those Olympic things? Look out, everyone. Daniel, we are all the way over here. Yeah. Oh, I have a question. Yes. Have you guys ever heard of cute aggression? No. So like when something like a dog or something is so cute, you like get aggressive yeah. because of how oh. cute it is? Well, now I've heard of it. I've I definitely seen that well. before. Like I've received that. Like people are always aggressive Kagan, with me. your dog is so cute. Oh yeah, my dog too. <laughs> yes, you guys are adorable. Okay, got jumps, I see. Oh yeah. <laughs> Basketball team is quaky. And as you can see, everyone in here comes from a basketball team. I've never felt more short in my life. Now he's been working on that for like 10 minutes. Poor guy. Hey, what's your name again? I didn't catch Steve. it. Steve? Steve? Okay, awesome. You cannot tell them his name is Steve. <laughs> I know, so I'm, 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 I'm not going to. Like I'm his, not going his to. His name's definitely not Steve, guys. Keegan, you want to ask maybe Steve his name? Who? Maybe Steve. See what? You want to see what his name is? No, I know what his name is. You know? Yeah. What's his name? I'm not telling you. It's Steve. Eric knows too. Eric. What is the guy's name? Aurora? It's Steve. It's Steve. I just asked him. I just went up and asked him. I don't believe you. This is the miscellaneous desk, so we're taking all the things that people don't really know what it is or where it is, and we're just kind of trying to find a place for it. Um, you know, immediately when they open boxes, you know, it's like, oh, this is a plate, this is a fork, this goes in kitchen stuff. But then we saw like a weird little sauerkraut filter or something like that, and nobody really knew what that was until we looked at it further. So we're just trying to identify what some of these weird items are and find them places.
helping and they're able to touch just because they're working in the warehouse for a day. It's like a really easy way to just like get into the community on campus because it's literally right down the street from campus so you know you're in a safe place and a safe spot. And on top of that, it just feels like really rewarding to give back to communities and give back to churches that like have helped people in so many spiritual ways. So yeah, that's why I decided to come back. decipher what's a tool and what's not a tool. Um, a toilet seat is a tool. I say it's a tool, but Keegan says it's not. Is a rim a tool? Are goggles a tool? A wheel cover is not a tool. How many college students does it take to figure out what is a tool? so much fun volunteering it felt really good to be able to help serve our community um, if you ever want to volunteer at city serve they're always looking for more volunteers but we'll see you guys next time bye Love's up. bye Love's up.